Hello and welcome to Pass the Turn. On today's episode, I'm going to be discussing some ultimatums. So I'm pretty excited right now, just having a look at some of the ultimatums that have just been uh, spoiled. And I can't believe my luck. I've got some amazing auto includes for my decks. Um, so first of all, we're gonna start with Ruinous Ultimatum. This will be going in my Kali uh, reanimation deck. And this is basically a cyclonic rift for Mardu, except it destroys all non-land uh, cards, non-land uh, permanents your opponents control. So it's basically a cyclonic rift. It is quite expensive, but it's still the same overall ma converted mana cost. And it's two red, uh, three planes, and two swamps. But this card is utterly insane. I mean, it's, it, it, you should be winning the game after casting this. You just drop that. Everyone else is back to square one and no chance to replay their goods. I mean, I wouldn't be surprised if this get banned. I really hope it doesn't because I want to at least play it a few times. But this is an amazing addition. I am so excited to add this to my deck and continue my horrific destroying permanence, reanimate my own plea. Anyway. Let's move on to the next one. So, uh, if you've watched the previous video, you'll know that I am looking forward to building a Biolante slash Nithori uh, reanimation deck because I am a uh, fanboy of anima uh, reanimation, or well, an anime to be fair, uh, and uh, another automatum for those colours. Amazing. This is a white uh, Plains Plains, uh, three swamps and two forests, and it's called Eerie Ultimatum. What this does, what does this read? Return any number of permanent, permanents with different names to the battlefield. That's ridiculous. It basically reanimate everything that you have in your graveyard. So that could be from, oh, your soul ring got destroyed. It got Vander blasted early in the game. Well, that's fine, that's back. Or you have been using and uh, let's go with a treasure map, fine, got that back. Uh, anything, literally, any permanent, like your forest, your your, your forest that you uh, discarded, even though, you know, I mean, well, you still might have discarded it, but that's ridiculous. It's just an, an insane card. This is an amazing reanimation card. I am really looking forward to building this reanimation deck, and I'm gonna have such, so much fun with this card. And uh, the last one I want to talk about is not specifically a card that I have a deck ready to go into yet, but something that I'm definitely interested in trying out, and that is uh, Emergent Ultimatum. So essentially what you're doing with this card is you will be choosing three mono coloured uh, cards, keyword there is cards, uh, and your opponent will choose one to shuffle away, and you get to have the other two onto the battlefield and then you exile this uh, card. But that is insane. I mean, there are so many combos that only take two cards, and there are so many combos out there that can use different pieces. So the opponent might choose one piece of the puzzle, but the other two pieces of the puzzle work together as well. And it's also just incredible value you can get from this. Okay, so thank you very much for tuning into this quick episode. I hope you enjoyed it. Um, let us know what you would build with these cards and um, don't forget to like and subscribe and hopefully we'll have some more pre-release content coming out. Thanks very much for watching, catch you soon.